Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. It is a Monday and I have a job. I've actually a couple jobs that I really want to do today. <laughs> you guys, they heard me. <laughs> That's so funny. I don't know who it is. I think it's a turkey. But as soon as I stopped talking, they heard me talking, they jumped up on that roof. Let's go see who it is. Is it a chicken or is it a turkey? Oh, it's a guinea. Just wait, I'm gonna show you. Oh my gosh. Can you guys see that? It is so adorable. There's four guineas right up there on that roof. Five guineas all in a row. They, they love me. <laughs> and I'm not even joking. They love me. And I love them. They are so friendly. They all take turns. They are a freaking adorable. This is my little posse. This is my first attempt at um, the short hair on the top, like a puppy cut. And I don't have rounded scissors. I almost bought them when I bought Ellie, but I didn't get them. And I think it turned out okay. I actually really like it and she seems really comfortable. Now I know why a lot of Yorkies look awful because their hair is definitely a lot of work. Oh, hi baby. Speaking of hair, do you guys know this is the longest my hair's been since I was a teenager? And it doesn't even look that long, but it is so long now that it rubs on my arm and on my chest. And I always think there's a bug there. I'm always swatting it away. Anyway, it's supposed to be summer this whole entire week. And today I wanna get this pool out of here. Sam and Sophie were out shopping this morning. Gabby is already feeling better. How are you feeling? Oh, thanks. I love it. I'm really into juice right now because my throat is still a little bit sore. Your, is your throat still sore? So if he's on her way to getting healthy. Anyway, we are going to try and, or I'm going to try and rip this pool down. And Sam and I are thinking, whoops, that we are going to use this liner for our pond for next year. Ta-da! So since this is the area that I've designated for my grandkids, I'm thinking that I should put a bunch of sand here so that all the weeds and the grass doesn't grow back. Put a bunch of sand here and then put a bunch of dump trucks and stuff in here and buckets and pails, that's my idea. So it's starting to be that time of the day. We've just been chilling. It's still, we are still not feeling awesome you guys. But anyway, it's that time of day. It's that time of day when we are getting ready to go do chores. We're a little bit early. I wanna go and see my horse. I haven't seen her like hardly at all today. But I wanna show you guys what happens when it starts to get about four o'clock in the afternoon. Everybody starts getting excited. Be really quiet and peek outside. Did you guys see it? A few seconds ago, they were sitting on that bench there. There was a bunch of them. And what they do, it's the guineas and the turkeys that love me. The guineas sit on that bench with the turkeys and they watch. They watch through this window because they can see through the window if they sit up there. But look at little Mr. Tom, he hears me. And then the ducks too. Do you have any treats? <laughs> Sophie, wait for me now. It's yeah, never it's enough. enough, it's never enough. She left me with three grapes. Let's see if they'll take it out of my hand. Here. Um, what you guys missed because... I don't want to feed you. You're I'll feed her, him. Yeah. I don't know where the girls are. I need to go find them. I've been outside doing some work around the property today and I haven't seen the girls at all. I'm trying to get like all that dirt dug up there so that it's like a nice flat area. Where are my girls? That's what's weird. Like my girl, he's been alone all day. Do okay, they? she wants me to hold it for her. I know, these ones are so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Not just, for you. Just let her, just let him have it. I'm scared of him. All right, let's go. I always try and do this thing where I do a decoy. The ducks never get to have anything. But if you throw it, the chickens hear and see. So I was trying to, <laughs> they hear it. Okay. Get throw something over there. I don't have any more. I, <laughs> I know, so you can never feed the ducks because they always hear when you throw something and then they all run. But let's go see. Let's go see what's wrong with my turkeys. 
Like that's the thing. When you really love your animals and you come out and suddenly something's different, it freaks you out. I'll save my last grape for the mama. Then put my food there. Oh, there they are. Where have you been all my life? Hey, look, I got a grape for you. Look. Oh, she's snotty. Do you want it? Huh. The turkeys don't care about me anymore, Sophie. <laughs> the girls. You don't see anything. What are you, uh, are you feeding them more grapes? I don't think they like the grapes. Literally already, my head feels lightheaded. I feel lightheaded because of this cold. I just want to enjoy these last, this last week of super warm weather. It's like 80 degrees here. Love the mood, you guys. It's just so gorgeous in here with all that beautiful sunlight. Hi, ladies. Ooh. I didn't bring any treats for you. Can you believe it? I brought treats for the chickens, but not for you. Sophie and Sam get sick worse than all the rest of us. I see her. And Sophie says that she can't catch her breath. Sophie's saying that she still literally can't catch her breath. I feel like I've only brushed her once last week. And it stresses me out because I know that she really enjoys it. The lady's like, that's so rude. You spend so much time with her. <laughs> But let's be real, it's lady, it's lady that gets all the attention. All right, you guys might as well, well know. Sophie, you might as well know too. Something happened to me recently and now I'm having a love affair with this, this mini. She's coming to me. I love her. All right, let's go, just wait. Get over here, get over here. Over here, right beside me. Oh, you traitor. Right, you were first, that's why. I don't know. I love her now. She's mine so bad. Because she's just so darn friendly. But don't worry, Penny. I still am going to brush you. And oh, she loves me now. I know. Straight towards me. Uh-oh. That does love you. <laughs> yeah. Come here, Pose. Come on. I don't like you being in here. Come here, baby. <laughs> oh. I don't like you being near the, it's a brush. You wanna try it? Look, it feels good. Doesn't it feel good? It feels good. Yep, she's, she'll take anything. Oh my gosh, now you're laying in the, look at, you look so fat, your arms look like they can't even touch the ground. But you know what, I've given her less food every day. But the last couple of days, she's looked chubby again. What in the heck? I find pigs are like the hardest to maintain their weight. Oh my gosh. That is good. That just took all the dry skin. Look at it. All right, well that is really cool. Let me just do it. I'm gonna do the boy too, look at it. Sophie, look at this. The boy's gonna eat He's gonna, oh, you stay away. I need to cut her bridle path. Look at that though. Do you guys see it? It looks like it snowed. Yeah, it looked like it snowed. It was it's posy snowed. Poor, poor baby. She always wants to come. But also, I need to get the lawnmower out here because all those weeds are really growing. Oh, like you guys don't even, well you guys know you've been sick. <laughs> I'm acting like I've never been sick, but I hardly have ever been sick. Oh, it just, yeah, you just feel weak. Whoa, <laughs> they don't like her. Nobody, none of the animals like her. Well, the horses like her. That's what's weird about honey is that every one of our horses babies her. Winston got traumatized by honey when he was a little baby. And Posey's been traumatized by her. Go. So, so you have to be better soon because literally, here, look at everybody's out now. They're all here. They're all like, where'd you go? I wasn't done. I know. I'm sorry. Where's my piggy? 
Let's see, I brought my brush. What happens? Hold on, hold on. Look, you see it? It's not for eating. Look, doesn't it feel good? Come here. Look, I can't even brush him. Oh, there, look. Doesn't it feel nice? Don't you try and jump on me, because I'm telling you right now, I'll fall over, I'm old. Oh my gosh. He likes it. He likes it. He likes it better than Posey. Oh my gosh. All I'm getting off him is dirt. No dead skin. Oh. Here, wanna do your face? Here, do your chin. <laughs> He's like, just feed me. All right, now that I'm down here, I feel like I just need to sit. Everything takes longer when you're sick. Every single thing. Oh, do you not know how to go up and down, Posey? How'd you get up there? Come on, you gotta go around the other way. All right, hold on, I'll get you. My poor piggy is locked out of her home. Come on, girly. I wonder if she can even fit through the fence anymore. Oh, you guys. I'm going to have to have a nap after this. Come on. Come on. You have to start staying where you live, Missy. Come on. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> Good girl. She knows exactly where to go. Oh, I bet you. I bet you she went right this way instead of to her stall. Because she knows where her stall is, too. Is she? Oh. All right, where'd she go? Did she go right to her stall? She might have. <laughs> what a good biggie, good girl. All right, so I literally lost you guys. We left, already walked up to the house. And then I said, oh no, where's the camera? And I had to come all the way back. Yeah, because I have so much energy for that. So uh, the thing about farming is that it's a physical job. And if you're a physical person, it's the perfect job. But if you're sick, it's not the perfect job. I woke up this morning feeling not too bad. But now it's nighttime and I'm not feeling too good. And I hate that the vlogs have always just been, we're sick, we're sick, but I can't help it. But now that it's fall, you guys, we have so much stuff. Every weekend we have something. And we have something fun this weekend too. Don't you know that you